Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and to a brand new FIFA 21 video. This is Leo here bringing you another Rule Breakers player review and today we are going to answer the question, is Jimenez Rule Breaker better than Baran? Guys, I will have an answer at the end of this review so stay tuned and hopefully you like this center back review. I have been doing a lot of center back reviews, I have reviewed uh, Militao, Klosterman, who else? Delaney, Walker, Joe Gomez. And now Jimenez is added to the list. The guy, the Uruguayan from Atletico Madrid, gets himself an incredible center back card. And with a huge, and I mean huge, pace upgrade. Guys, 282. I don't have his original card with me at my side. I don't have my phone, so I'm sorry about that. But yeah, 82 pace comprises of 80 acceleration, 84 sprint speed, which is fantastic. That is exactly what this card needed. I have not played with Jimenez, so I don't really know how his original gold card is but that 82 pace is really tasty on to the passing of 61 and it's okay I guess 80 short passing 75 long passing as long as he can get it out of trouble when my opponent is pressuring that is all I need from my center back so we shall see if he's able to do that on to the 60 uh, uh, 60 dribbling oh my goodness 58 agility 43 balance that is a little bit worrisome, hopefully that doesn't affect him as much because he does have 85 reactions which is a key stat for a center back in my opinion, 80 composure is good enough for me so I can call him clutch on to his second best stat on the card and that's going to be that 83 dribbling, eight, oh my goodness Leo, 83 defending, sorry guys, uh, 83 defending is fantastic, 82 interceptions, 85 defensive awareness, and 84 standing tackle, if I press circle he should win the ball back from anybody and everybody coming his way and lastly the physical his best stat 85 and that comprises of 90 stamina and 89 strength so you can comfortably put a shadow on him just max out the pace max out the defending and you'll be good to go because his strength and aggression is elite level and he reminds me he reminds me of uh from diego carlos because diego carlos has really good physical as well and then lastly guys the player traits injury prone and dives into tackle guys i'm so excited to try out he met his rule breaker is he the best center back in la liga we shall see next Game number one in, it is an incredible side, he has Neymar Paulinho Talisca, which I've been meaning to do, I've heard really good things about him, but talking about rule breakers, it is time for to show out us and see if these purchases were worth it. Nice, look at that, first tackle for Jimenez in the third minute of the ball game, that's what you love to see, last week it was Laporte, this week it is Jimenez. Alright, vamos. Gomez, this is your time to shine. Gomez. Nice. Why did I say... Why did I say Gomez? I meant to say Jimenez. Ay, yeah, yeah. Now he's mad at me for calling him Gomez. Let's see. Come on. That's Neymar. Nice interception. Jimenez and great pass right there. Beautiful pass right there. Oh my goodness. Not a lot of center backs can create that pass. And honestly, I'm liking... Look at that. Another accurate pass. Ah, another accurate pass by Jimenez. That is key, man. Because this guy's pressuring like crazy. And he gets the standing tackle. What a way to end the clip. Yeah. Almost Jimenez. Let's go. I just killed him. Well, that will conclude game number one for Jimenez. I called him Mukiele. I called him Joe Gomez. I called him several things during this review, but it doesn't matter. Jimenez, 6.6 .6 rating. He was a defensive wall. Let's go straight into the tackles. One, two out of three. Dribbles completed eight out of nine. And then passes completed nine out of 11. That is the stat, aside from defending, that impressed me the most on Jimenez. He was able to pass it out of trouble. This guy was pressuring like crazy. That's why he was able to get two goals on me. I gotta get. I just gotta play more concentrated when I'm doing these reviews. But we get the W anyways. And Jimenez was a big part of that. Stopping Neymar a bunch of times, to be honest. And that should tell you how good this Jimenez card is. But anyways, let's go on to the second game and see if he can duplicate his performance. What a squad! Wow, OP meta everywhere you see. There is a meta player. 
Nice tackle right there. I messed up with ba with Barzaglico, whatever his name is. He's just there for the links. I should really sub him off, but whatever, man. All right, come on against Marcus Rashford. Get out of here. Rashford, one of the better players in FIFA. Oh, my gosh, the lag, guys. But anyways, that doesn't stop the fact that Jimenez is stopping Rashford right now. Beautiful Jimenez. Standing tackle is A1, guys. I had to stay quiet just to concentrate because this game is so laggy. Oh my goodness, Jimenez! I tried to switch to the midfielder right there to cover that pass and he just switched to Jimenez. He knows we're, we're, he knows we're recording him. Nice, what a way to end the first half for Jimenez. Perfection from Jimenez once again. Nice, hi <laughs> Jimenez. No, uh, I just I have no words for this card. It is a fantastic center back card. Definitely one of the best and good options for La Liga Santander to keep an eye out because he is shutting down Rashford. And this guy's pretty good, honestly. What a way to end the review for Jimenez! A standing tackle in the 90th minute. And yeah, guys, we are going to go into the, another victory in Division 1 for Jose Maria Jimenez. I believe that's his name. His middle name. I know they posted. I think it's Jose Maria Jimenez. But <laughs> who cares about that? What I care about is a 7.3 .3 rating for Jimenez. Fantastic performance. Guys, we won another game with him at center back. Him and Baran are a really good partnership, guys. So that might be something you might want to look at. Tackles won 5 out of 7. Game high 5 tackles out of 7. Crosses completed 0 out of 0. Dribbles completed 5 out of 6. Passes completed 8 out of 8. Another impressive stat from Jimenez. But anyways, that will conclude the gameplay portion of this review. Let's go on to the final thoughts on Jimenez Rule Breakers card. Wow, what a phenomenal review for Jimenez. Rule Breaker card. This center back is honestly one of the best center backs in the Liga Santander. And honestly, guys, I'm going to answer the question, is he better than Baran later? But let's just go straight into the pros first. And then we'll get to the big question, the big reveal. First, guys, the pro obviously is going to be that 82 pace of his. That pace increases. Definitely felt he was able to catch up to a lot of pacey strikers that came along his way. So that is a good thing to have in a center back. Onto the second pro is going to be that 85 reaction. And that comes into play whenever you're trying to intercept or like just do a standing tackle. That reaction, it comes in clutch, man, honestly. Onto the third pro is going to be that 90 strength. This guy is strong and he will bully any striker. That is on your opponent's side to be honest. So yeah, go ahead and put a shadow on him and you'll be good to go. You don't even need to increase that. But if you do, he'll be even more strong. And then lastly, the other pro. And the last pro on this card is going to be that 84 standing tackle. Use press circle. And he should win, it the, win the ball back for you 100% of the time. And that is a wonderful thing to have. A reliable center back back there. On to the cons. He does have the two cons. Obvious cons on this card is going to be that 58 agility. And 43 balance, definitely a con there. He does feel a little bit clunky. Sometimes the opponent will do like a like a skill move and it'll take him a second to recover. But he does recover, so that is the big pro there. And now on to the Leo Tips. Pair him next to Baran or Diego Carlos, guys. That is a perfect partnership. And if you can, Van Dyke, guys. Oh, oh my goodness. If you pair him up with Van Dyke, you'll be good to go. You'll probably get a lead. Nobody will be able to get past that side. And that will lead to a final rating of 9 out of 10, guys. He is a really fantastic center back in the big reveal guys is he better than baran no i don't think he is better than baran so if you have the coins guys purchase baran get mendy and get the hyperlink going and then if you want and you have the extra coins add this jimenez but as of right now i think the number one center back in the liga santander is baran for me but anyways i will conclude today's review hopefully helped you out in deciding whether you want to pick up this card or not i highly advise you do if you run a liga santander side you got some great links to this card all the center back the good center 
center backs in the Liga Santander, and then that Marcos Llorente, rule breaker as well, another green link to add to the Jimenez and make it easier for you to do a hybrid. But before I let you go, guys, this will conclude this review, and I just want to say thank you so much for your support on Instagram and YouTube lately. Y'all have been killing it with the support, and I love seeing that, guys. Please take a second out of your day, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and that'll be all for today. This is Leo. I bid you goodbye and good night.